What's up? This is Mike Orlando from Adrenaline Mob. In today's lesson, we'll be going over some two-handed tapping techniques that I call percussive tapping. It's basically derived from drum patterns. I'm, I'm very, you know, into drummers and the styles and grabbing triplets and quads and applying them to uh, the technique on the guitar. So that's what I'll be going through in the next lick. <laughs> So basically, the lick is derived of uh, groups of threes. The main riff is two groups of threes and two. So it's one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two. And then what I do is four groups of triplets, which is the faster tapping part. And what I do is go from chord to chord. I'll start in E, then I'll go to A, and then it goes back to E, to B, to A, to, to G, F sharp, and chromatically F down to E. And that's the basic idea of it. So it's, it's very uh, derived, like I say, from patterns. One, two, three, one, two. And then that tick. And I just apply it to the guitar, uh, you know, like a drummer would a beat. I'll show it to you slow. How I feel the one, the downbeat, is the one, two, three, one, two, three, one. And it jumps on that last one. Um, that's the feel of it, to get that one, two, three, one, two, three, bam. One, two, three, one, two, three, bam. So, da, do, do, da, do, bam. And then the triplets are always, the, the one is always the first note. That's basically it's slow. I'll do it one more time. So basically after that, I'll do that a few times around, and then I jump to the A position, which is the same technique, the one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, and groups of fours of triplets. So I'll play it slow. After the A position, then I go back to the E, which we explained before, and then I jump up to the 5, which is the B, and it goes like this slowly. And then I move down to the A position. Same lick, and then I move it down to the G position. Now this is where I group it in triplets, three. I use this technique in a lot of songs, a lot of different ways, different keys, different timing, quads, triplets, sixes, eights. There's a lot of different ways we could do it, and I'll be showing you that in the next coming lessons. Thanks.